Yo, what's going on guys, ODC Drone Fair here and I've got a bit more Black Ops 2 information for you today and basically this is all about this image right in front of you. I've only got one image for you but this is quite an interesting image, it's really important, it shows a lot of information, there's three things I want to talk about in this image and it is actually from Zombies, it was a leaked image from um, someone who's got Black Ops 2 early, they've leaked, they've, they've took this image maybe by their phone, it's not very great quality, so I think, I'm assuming they've just took a quick picture of their phone and it's got leaked online, it's all over Twitter and it was everywhere else, so I just quickly want to go over it and just talk to you guys about it. Now right at the bottom it says headshots only, everyone knows what this is, basically you can enable so that you can only kill the zombies with headshots. Um, by the way so guys this is a zombies map and it is farm as you can see in the bottom it says farm and it says survival so the map's called farm and the uh, game mode is survival now survival is the classic game mode where you just have rounds and you've got to get to the furthest round it's not 4 vs 4 or anything like that it's just the, the classical game mode from the previous zombies now it says green run at the top and I'm not sure if it's green run farm or it green run something else it's the type of survival I don't know exactly what that is um, anyway the most important things are the other three things and this is difficulty the starting round and magic now magic's a new thing that's been introduced and he has actually got magic enabled on this so this should be a private match will be and he's going to have magic enabled I'm not sure if you can have magic only for private matches or you can have it for other matches as well but that's quite an interesting thing we ain't got much information on magic yet but we should be getting more information on it very soon now the top one is difficulty and difficulty is going to be easy medium and hard and they're basically it says it all everyone knows what difficulty is and that's quite interesting as well because i know a lot of people like a challenge and also people that aren't as good on zombies they like it to be a lot easier because zombies can be quite hard for a lot of people and it can also be easy for a lot of people so it's good to change it about now this thing is the next one which is the starting round i've been waiting for this for ages i've always wanted this to come out of zombies and i'm so excited to play it because Always when I played zombies there was always a problem of starting all over again. It was always a long period and I, I think what they're going to do is if you get to round 20 you're going to be able to start at any round from 20 or lower. Um, so you won't be able to start on 25 straight away when you haven't even, when your furthest you've got is round 10. You have to get to the round before you can start on that round. But that means you can get to 25 and then you might die and then you can start again on 25 and make sure you, you can keep doing it until you complete that round. Which is really interesting. And it does get quite long as well so, because if you start from round 1 it, it could take you an hour or two hours to get just just to get to round 20 when you just want to start round 20 straight away now for the rounds what i think they're going to do is if you start around say for instance you always start round one on multiplayer in private matches you're going to be able to choose your round obviously and i reckon if you start around 10 or you start around 15 or something like that i reckon you're going to have less points you're not going to start with a good weapon you're going to have no weapons you're going to start with your pistol and I reckon you're going to start with the usual points as well. So you're going to have to build up your points, which is going to make it harder for you. But it makes it more interesting because you don't want to start on round one again. You want to start around 10 with no points. I'd rather start around 10 with no points and no weapons than start around one with no points and no weapons. And that's it for this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Give me a like if you do. And comment and let me know what you think about this picture. And if there's anything you think I missed, then just comment it below and let me know about it. Thanks for watching the video, guys. And I'll see you very soon.